see Windows cursors and select the cursor of your choice. Make sure you select only the Mac one, okay? Then when you're done with all the cursors, then click save as and save the file. Uh, I'm gonna save the Mac cursor, there they are. And then I'm clicking OK and here are my cursors. Okay, two down now. And then now comes window blinds. This is the most important thing now. You can just open it and install it. Install this Windows 7 one public sorry. And then when you're done, just uh, start it from your um, no, uh, start menu, then just start dock, then up to desktop, and then window blinds. And then this window is gonna come come up. Then you gotta open a window blinds folder again. And, uh, double click on this Mac OS X Tiger, okay? When you do that, a balloon type of thing should come out of here, say a new theme has been installed. And when you get the balloon, just uh, open up that window blind thing again. Just scroll to the right until you find um, Mac OS X Tiger by Steve Rainier. Okay. Just click on that, it will show you a preview of the skin. And click on apply changes on the top left. It's gonna apply the changes. Okay, so half of our work is already done. The window buttons are on the left here. Now you can close this window blind. But the problem is this taskbar looks really ugly. So what I'm gonna do is just move this up now, and it's time for WinMac. Just open the Win WinMac folder, and there it's got lots of files in it. But you gotta run the setup.exe file there. Okay, you gotta set run it, and when you install it, run it from the start menu. It will look like. Uh, There, WinMac, there it is. Okay, uh, just click on that. It will probably make a shortcut in your desktop too if you tell it to. And there you go, you have a nice finder bar up there. Now, how to get rid of this taskbar? WinMac's done. Now we'll go to Mac OS X Sounds. Okay, these are the oh, you know, official Iceman theme sounds more like, and you can apply these sounds your you know PC I'll install them just right click anywhere in your desktop and oh no not anywhere in desktop go to control panel and then to sounds uh, sound sounds and change system sound this box is gonna come up and then you select an asterisk you click on browse and go to the folder that you just downloaded and select the sound of your choice when you're done just uh, save 